Hi guys, it's me, Matt, the Magman, saying hello again. Talking to you today about three-dimensional shapes and the names and properties of some of our more common three-dimensional shapes. So, you guys will totally be doing this in, a, in your classroom at the moment. This is good for year one and year two. So what we have here is a funny looking shape. It looks like a triangle, but it's in 3D. In fact, it's made up of uh, triangles. You see, this is of course the tetrahedron. Absolutely lovely shape, tetrahedron. Nice and simple, good, easy one to make this one. Ah, now here's one I'm sure you'll all recognize. It looks like a slightly longer square, doesn't it? Like a stretched out cube. But it's not a cube, it is a cuboid. A cuboid. Makes it sound like an alien, I think. A cuboid, it's coming. That's kind of what that sounds like. So that's a cuboid. Ah, oh, we all know this one, don't we? Look at that. It's like a ball or a, a globe, the world, or a planet, or something like that. It is, of course, the almighty sphere. Oh, yes, a sphere, a beautiful round shape. Only got one face, not me. <laughs> there we go, that is the sphere. Ah, oh, everybody knows this one. I've made a nice big one. It's, it's like a, a die, or, you know, when you're playing a, a board game and you have to use the dice. It's one of those, isn't it? It's a cube. What a three-dimensional square would look like. A cube. I like that one a lot. Ah, oh, these two are my, my favourites. We have this one, which if you looked in your cupboard at home, I'm sure you would find uh, like a, a, a tin of beans, or a can of, of sweet corn or something like that. It looks like that. It's got it flat on the top and it's flat on the bottom and it's curved all the way around. This is the glorious cylinder. <laughs> yeah, like a drain pipe or a, anything like that. Yes, a cylinder. Last but not least, particularly good for a hot summer's day, I think, or perhaps close to Halloween, one of the two. This is a cone. It looks like a witch's hat, doesn't it? Or like an ice cream cone. I can imagine holding that and I'd have my ice cream on there and I'll be well away. That's only got two faces, you see. It's got a flat face there and then wrapping around it all the way around in a nice point, like a witch's hat, is the second face. So there we are. They are some of your very common three-dimensional shapes. Why don't you have a look around your house? See if you can't find some cool shapes. Um, there we are then. So, three-dimensional shapes. Please feel free to like and subscribe. It does us the world of good. It means I can keep on making these. Wonderful. Anywho, I'll see you guys soon. Uh, stay safe, wash your hands, and uh, 